Hey, this is Zach with Savage Traveling, coming to you from Safe Harbor Marina in Sandusky, Ohio. Uh, we're going sailboating today. Um, not this one. It's actually down here. I'm, I'm going to show you that in a minute, but I just want to tell you, like I said, we're here at Safe Harbor here in Sandusky, Ohio. My buddy has a 33-foot hunter uh, sloop. Um, we're going to go out and try to sail it today. Uh, we took it out for a little motor test yesterday. It was only his second time out in a while, obviously my first. And uh, so today we're going to go try to put the sail out. So uh, you guys should come along and enjoy that and see what kind of shenanigans we get into. So once again, guys, uh, enjoy. There she is, the one with the canoe. <laughs> yeah, this is 133 um, sloop. It's a 1980. Uh, I slept on it last night. Uh, better than sleeping in the van. <laughs> I'll tell you that. Uh, come aboard. All right, guys, we are getting ready to uh, push off. Captain Keith is uh, needs my help. <laughs> shore power. Get rid of the shore power here. Definitely don't want to take off. Still connected to the electricity. Seal that again like we didn't do once. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's important. Yeah, it feels like it. I mean, if I would hate for that to get wet. You might short out the whole boat. Yeah, it is. Like, I'm not sure. I would hate to short out your whole boat. Oh, look at that. Look at them. Well, see, they pushed it over here. Huh? They pushed it from here to here so he could pull right out like that. From this side to here. Oh, really? Yes. Yes, they were over there this morning. Yeah, he's a pro. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, she knew how to use her stick. Just tell me when. Just making sure that it's not moving. No, you're fine. Not in here. No, no, you haven't you haven't you haven't lurched. Ready? Yeah, it should be. All right, you're, uh, is it the bow is untethered. Okay, so whenever you let me that flat one off, I'll kick it in reverse. Just give me the word. Go ahead and release it. Oh yeah, we're turning today. Oh, 
Oh, dude, you barely made that out. Look at that. I think that wind was really fighting you yesterday. It was for sure. Had to be. What's going on? It just got pulled to the side a little. All right. Other way, other way, other way, other way. Okay. Yeah, I, I didn't notice you drifting. Yeah, for sure. It's the Sandusky Coal Transfer Station, or whatever you want to call it. It's like a seaport and a train depot where they haul coal everywhere. And then straight across there to the left of the coal is Cedar Point Sandusky. We'll, we'll get a closer look in a minute. quit working our steering wheel we are we are out of steering where's that what do i need to get there's like a metal i don't even know what piece or something. i have i don't think i've I seen know. it it's great Nothing there. No, it's got nothing to it. You can hear it banging. Yeah. Oh my gosh. We were just talking about this. Yep, for sure. I don't know how to fucking turn that shit. It felt like it had a lot of it. It wasn't like it was just tough or not. This is an unfortunate turn of events. I don't know what we're gonna do about this yet. I'll check back with you in a moment and see if we have a solution, but we are literally dead in the water out here. Um, there is Cedar Point. This is the little path we had to get to to get to Lake Erie. Uh, I don't know if we're gonna 
do that. <laughs> still no headway on the rudder situation supposedly we have a tool that we can fit down into this hole and control the rudder from here but uh we're still looking for that tool so, so right now like i said we're just bobbing out here there's a paraglider cedar point hunter 33 pretty much dead in the water like the path of the big boats like there's a certain path the big boats have to take through there and we're pretty much just setting right in it because you know that buoy lets us know that yeah we were going to go out far today so it's probably better that this happened here even though we're nowhere near where we need to be as in the, the marine is back there but better this happened here than in open water because I don't know what we're gonna do. Uh, he does have boat tow, so we might have to get towed back in if I don't flop off this thing. All right, back to work. Okay, we had to call sea tow. This may be him, but rescue is on its way. That is sea tow. Yeah.
him? I think so. Yeah, the, he's on the end of my dock. Or he's pointing. Yeah. This is, I don't know what Take he, this one, yeah. clean it off, and then we'll get your, ready? Yeah. Clear it through your file. And then you guys can back off and he'll just drift over. We'll get him over there. Are you ready? Yeah. You got four feet on this side. Clean it off. We'll pull you over. Here's these off now? Yep. Okay. Okay. Smart. <laughs> yeah, wise. Very wise. Oh, there's a Yeah, probably. That's what I was wondering. <laughs> You always got good help here at the dock. It's, a it's hard telling. I ended up using the phone number, so I gave oh, yeah. them all my info on the phone, but I probably got something signed. I got that the day I bought the boat. Yeah, nice. <laughs> no, that's a, just as important as the boat itself. Yeah. <laughs> YouTube uh, we're back at the marina uh, parked into the slip they got us right where we needed to be and uh, we're gonna check out and see what we can find wrong with this so uh, thanks for coming along the venture today it was uh, more than I anticipated but uh, glad I could take you along with me uh, if you liked what you see please like and subscribe and then join us for the next one but until then peace